Penang is one of the most developed and economically important states in Malaysia. A popular tourist destination, it draws thousands of visitors each year to see its rich natural beauty and cultural heritage. On the other side of Penang's success and beauty is another story. Every day in Penang State, about 1,800 tons of waste is generated. In one year, this is about 650,000 tons. Of Penang's waste, about 40 to 60 percent is food and garden waste. Waste that could be composted to help protect our environment and extend the lives of our landfills. Our food waste and organic waste can be easily processed or composted and returned to agriculture to produce more food. Food and organic waste are broken down by beneficial microbes in nature into useful products such as liquid soil conditioners, compost and humus. We are trying to mimic the natural process by separating and processing food waste and organic waste as source so that they do not end up in the landfill as harmful greenhouse gases. When food waste is mixed with other landfill wastes, they create dangerous landfill gases that hurt our environment. These landfill gases comprise about 50 to 55 percent methane and 40 to 45 percent carbon dioxide. Methane is a potent greenhouse gas that is 20 times more harmful to the atmosphere than carbon dioxide. According to the Penang Organic Waste Policy, Penang Nights must divert and reduce the amount of such waste going to the landfill to avoid the generation of methane, which is a greenhouse gas, thereby saving costs in terms of collection, transportation and treatment in the later stage. In addition to extending the lifespan of the landfill, other discards can be easily recycled if they do not come into contact with the wet organic waste portion. In order to achieve this, Penang Nights are encouraged to separate their organic waste as source of generation so that such organic waste could be transformed into useful byproducts. So, how do you identify which wastes are organic and compostable? Organic wastes include these. Inorganic wastes include these. Separating your waste is easy to do. The state of Penang is working with international partners to encourage citizens to compost. The urban services departments of Pulau Pinang and Seberang Prai are piloting these composting projects in various high-rise residential buildings. In individual buildings, participating households are encouraged to separate their compostable waste. As an incentive, if they successfully separate based on the quantity and the quality of their waste separation, their housing block will receive a cash reward from the municipal government. Saya mengasingkan sisa-sisa makanan daripada sisa-sisa yang lain dan memasukkan ke dalam kontena kas untuk dihantar ke mesin pengusiran sisa makanan di kawasan perumahan saya. Ia adalah senang dibuat dan ia boleh menghasilkan produk lain yang amat berguna. A food waste caddy in your kitchen can help you separate your food waste for recycling and composting. Keep it out of direct sunlight and keep the lid closed. <laughs> 